so as you see in this uh, in this video uh, this is 3d printing so 3d printing is nothing but as a process of making a physical object from a three dimensional digital model so the three dimensional digital model uh, can be made using any kind of uh, 3d modeling software before going to the 3d printing we have to uh, make that 3d model into a slice so you know to make a uh, n number of slices this stl format have to be converted into g code this process is called slicing so slicing is a process of converting the 3d model into an, a slice, sliced object so this sliced object have been feeded to the uh, 3d printer so 3d printer start working with a layer by layer process it start printing from the layer 1 layer 2 and layer 3 until the object created so until the complete object is, has been created uh, it start printing the process uh, once the printing process has been started we cannot uh, pass or we cannot stop the process in between so if any kind of any disturbance are interrupt in between the middle of the process the whole uh, object printing have to be collapsed so this is uh, this is about 3d printing the uh, coming to the 3d printing uh, there will be a there will be a kind of material we, have, we can able to use there will be a two kinds of materials so abs abs is a kind of a chemical material like a, it's a kind of a polymer polymer so acrylobutadiene styrene it's a kind of a polymer so uh, there will be another kind of material like pla polylactic acid it's a kind of a natural material we can able to get it from uh, corn corn starch so from the starch material of the corn we can able to uh, make a product called uh, pla material so it's a kind of a thermoplastic so the melting point of this material pla material is around uh, 210 degrees celsius uh, as you see in the display so the melting uh, point is around 210 degrees Celsius. So this is a PLA material we have choose. So this is uh, 3D printing how are happening. So at the center you will be seeing nozzle. So this nozzle will be melting that uh, uh, melting at 210 degrees Celsius. So at the bottom there you, you can see the there will be a heating bed. So this this bed is supported with uh, by the bottom there will be a belt. Uh, drived by the stepper motor. This stepper, uh, bottom stepper motor will be controlling the forward backward of, uh, of the heating bed. Uh, uh, there you will be seeing uh, like a nozzle. This nozzle uh, ha also be having supported with a uh, belt strike structure with this stepper motor. This stepper motor will be controlling the left and uh, right movement of the nozzle. Uh, this is a left side motor this is a right side motor these two motors uh, have been adjusted for uh, for a uh, for a vertical movement of the nozzle so uh, as you see the the whole control unit you can see here so there will be a usb cable uh, we, which we can able to upload the program like we can able to upload the uh, digital file into this uh, controller using this uh, using via this uh, usb cable and also there will be there will be a micro sd card slot so in that sd card we can able to transfer the digital file like uh, we can able to make the g code as directly